there's so many different um, journeys that are going on through the film for my character, Nat. Your psychological evaluation shows no evidence of psychosis. Um, we did, however, find a trace of benzodiazepine in your blood. For a couple of years, she uh, kind of moved towards coming to terms with her own mental health. So I think she had mental health issues. I think she had issues with addiction. All of a sudden, all these really bizarre and horrific things start happening to her. And she starts to question, I think, her own... Um, she's thinking those mental health issues are probably coming back. And, you know, that kind of intense fear of, um, is this happening to my daughter as well? Have I passed on something to my daughter? It was the girl in my room. What girl? I don't know her name. Hang on, maybe it's not me. Maybe it's not my daughter, maybe, just maybe we're actually being haunted by something. I think there's something in my house. I must say, I've never done anything as gruelling. I'd look at the call sheet and just go, oh wow, okay, this is what I have to do today. And just so much emotional stuff. At one point, I had to, I took a few people from the crew aside and just said, look, if it looks like I'm not having a good time for the next week. It's not that. <laughs> I'm just, I just really need to sort of stay in it. It was too hard to switch from, you know, happy-go-lucky Kesty to Nat, who was going through, like, the worst days of her life. Not only was she perfect for the role, but all the range that was required across the film, she managed to get up for all of those scenes. I would always go back to the script and just kind of clarify what I was doing. And then of course, at the end of the day, you've got to let all that go and just kind of be in the moment. There were times when sometimes you're just like, I don't know, I actually don't know what I'm doing. I don't know what I'm doing. And that's when you rely on, you know, your director to kind of bring you back to where you're supposed to be and to remind you what the scene's about. I loved working with Kesty. You know, she really carried the major share of the film as the actress. Uh, she had long hours, long days, and it's very easy to just phone in a couple of takes. Not one take did she give one inch less than she gave the take before. Uh, every actor on that set was equally important to her. Um, she was a generous actress. Oh, 